My name is Nancy Knowlton and I'm the CEO of Smart Technologies. In 1987, my husband and I started the company with a view about uh, creating an interactive uh, whiteboard. And uh, my husband had had the idea uh, in 1986 and we saw an opportunity to make the work that groups of people, whether they were in meeting rooms or classrooms, just that much more effective. Uh, taking uh, what was really a, a personal computer at that time and turning it into a group computer. So I heard you are introducing some new product here at in in Infocom 2008. Can you introduce the three highlight products? We're introducing a large number of products here. Uh, three products fit into the corporate market space. Uh, the first product is a meeting productivity uh, product. It's called uh, Meeting Pro. It's a software application that allows the occasional user that goes into a meeting room uh, just be very comfortable in, uh, in conducting a meeting. So it's a simplified uh, tool. It doesn't offer uh, everything, but uh, it, it does have a very streamlined uh, user interface, making it very direct, very specific, very easy for uh, people to choose what it is that they want to do. What are some highlight features? Okay. <laughs> So, well, there are so many features, it's hard to pick a highlight feature, but uh, I'd just say the, the main thing is the simplicity of uh, the user interface. It really presents the user with a limited number of, of options, and I would just contrast that with uh, what you might see if you were to just have a, a typical PC interface. I mean, you literally have thousands of options. You can open literally any program. And sometimes for uh, people, it's kind of daunting to look at really what amounts to the desktop of another individual. In a meeting room, the PC is a shared uh, device. And so what I might like to have configured on my PC might not be the way that that PC was left. So by taking that away, limiting the number of options that people have, just a, a limited number of whiteboarding tools, that gives them the confidence that what they want to do, they can do. When this will be available? Is it already available? And do you have some price general information? Well, the uh, product is already available. We announced it on May uh, 21st. And the pricing of the product is really uh, based on the number of displays that you want to have connected uh, via the software. So you'll still have a single uh, PC in, 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 in certain instances, and in others you'll have multiple uh, connected uh, computers and, and uh, either interactive displays or interactive whiteboards. And so the, pro the, the pricing of that depends upon the, the actual configuration, and it's so broad that it may not be that meaningful to, to advise you. Corporate solutions have been designed specifically for the needs of the occasional user. It's a very different market than the education market because the occasional user uh, in corporate requires the ability just to walk in and get started with their meeting. So while we're providing advanced functionality available, we are providing it in a simplified interface that supports that user's desire just to walk in and start whiteboarding. So as you can see here, I just want to walk in um, and go right into the whiteboarding application where I can pick up a pen and start writing notes. Now, as you can see, when you look at the bottom left-hand portion of the screen here, it's still a very simplified interface that supports the needs of the occasional user. We don't want anybody to feel intimidated when they walk up to start using the application. However, there is more advanced functionality that is available. Um, so if the user wants, as they start progressing along that learning curve and becoming more familiar with the solutions, there's options available to support them. In addition, this solution includes not only integrated, but also automated conferencing as well. So as soon as a meeting host walks into a room, they have a uniquely generated meeting name and password that's created specifically for their meeting. Really reduces the steps required for them to walk in and begin their collaborative brainstorming session. Furthermore, we've tried to create a solution that really works well with the existing applications that a user will use in the corporate market. Microsoft Office is fairly very, is quite prevalent in this market, so we've provided the ability to support a user's desire just to walk in and start using an application right away. So if they want to make annotations on this application, they can make annotations um, and highlight where changes need to be made, and then simply by touching the screen, they can take a picture and that will be saved as part of their meeting notes.
Uh, furthermore, this solution also supports multiple displays. Now, there are some, re there are some uh, environments where multiple display support is required. Obviously, the meeting room requirements can vary based on the size of the room, and our solutions are designed to fit every room that an organization has. So in this case, when we take a look at the multiple display support, it's very easy for myself as a meeting host to be easily to present multiple sets of information to my audience uh, simultaneously. So as you can see here, I can take this and I can move that screen uh, directly over to the other display very simply and easily so that I can actually, um, so that I can load multiple sets of information uh, and s present those simultaneously. Now I have application files running, I have meeting notes, and I also have an automated conference that was created for me. However, my meeting is up and the next group would like to use this meeting room. So I have a one-step process of the end meeting where it will prompt me to shut everything down, to save my meeting notes to a network drive or to a USB key, and it will then create a new meeting automatically for the next group that walks into the room asking them, what would you like to do today?